well with your questions. I'm just not accustomed to talking about my past very much. At all. I'm more used to taking action. Keeping my mind focused on the business at hand. So let's just do that. If you have more questions, ask them later. Hello there. I haven't seen you in my shop before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Kebla Yurt. Welcome to the Equipment Emporium. You looking to buy some supplies? My shop's the largest one in all of Upper Terrace. Best selection on the planet. Whatever you need, I've got. Well, mostly. Mostly? What do you mean by that? The Sith confiscated all my heavy weapons, and they impounded all my ships and swoop bikes. But I've still got a real nice selection, if you're interested. Just so you know, the prices on the items are final. No bargaining here. This isn't a swap meet, okay? I only deal in top-notch stuff. Don't you just love watching the Kazakh players? All that strategy, all those credits. It's enough to make a girl get all flushed. Oh, Ivan, have you come here just to bother me, or do you wish to test yourself against the best Kazakh player on Taurus? <laughs> My name is Niklos. I'm the unofficial champion of the Pazak circuit here on Taurus. If you don't mind losing your wager, we could play a few hands. You don't even have your own deck? Then why are you bothering me? You can't play Pazak without your own deck. If you're serious about Pazak, go speak to old Garok on the other side of the tavern. His gambling days are over and uh, he's looking to sell his deck. Hi there. I haven't seen you around before. Of course, they don't give us Sith officers from the military base much time off. I'm off duty right now, so I'm not in uniform. My name is Sana, junior officer first class with the Sith occupation force. I'm actually a little surprised you're talking to me at all. Most of the people here on Taris can't stand us Sith. We can make this job pretty lonely. That's true, but people don't appreciate what we've done for them. We could have slapped a curfew on this whole planet, but we didn't. You know, it's like everyone on this backwater planet is in a permanent bad mood. Don't they know we have to make the best of things? Exactly, it's all about attitude. I didn't ask to be assigned to this backwater planet, but I try to make the best of it. It's pretty easy to get depressed on an assignment like this, but we do what we can to keep our spirits up. That's true. It's nice to meet someone who understands what I'm going through. It's good to talk about this stuff. It gets pretty lonely at the military base. I have to get going soon. I've got a ship to the military base. But some of us junior Sith officers are having a party tonight to blow off some steam. I'd really like to see you again. Why don't you drop by the party? I'll show you where it is on your map. Don't be late. We're starting right after our ship's end. Most of us won't even be going back to the base to lock up our uniforms. I look forward to seeing you there. What? 
Why are you speaking to me? Can't you tell from my clothing that I'm of the nobility? Get away from me. I can't be seen talking with a common rabble. It wouldn't be proper for a man of my style. Did you get those clothes? A trash compactor in the lower city? And where are those drinks you ordered? Careful what you say. I get the feeling this spoiled brat could cause us more trouble than she's worth. Why is the help here so incompetent? One word from Daddy and I could get you fired. That's better. Now, hurry up with our order. Here, here are your drinks, Miss Lavin. I apologize for the delay. Do I know you? No? This cantina isn't the fanciest joint I've ever been in. If you're here to complain about the quarantine, don't waste your breath. There's nothing I can do about it. I just follow the orders I'm given. I can't believe we couldn't get arena tickets for this match! Now we'll have to watch the duel on the view screen. Who cares? It's Duncan and Gerlon fighting. It's not like we're gonna miss anything good. Shh, they're about to start, so quit complaining and just watch the view screen. Ladies and gentlemen, I draw your attention to the viewing ring. Here, two combatants will battle for your viewing and gambling enjoyment. Now, I hope all your bets are down because we're ready to roll. In this corner, I give you Gerlon and over here, looking to climb the ranks yet again, is the ever-persistent Jedi Duncan! <laughs> and to nobody's great surprise, Jedi is gone again! Don't worry, folks. He's just unconscious. As usual, our medics will have him up and about in a bit. Well, that was quick, wasn't it? So I give you the winner, Gerlon Twofinger. I haven't seen you around here before. You looking to step into the duel ring? Or did you just come to watch? What? Why are you here if you don't even know what the dueling ring is? I don't have time to answer your questions. I need to stay focused for my next match. Maybe Azure can help you out. He's the hut over there in the corner. He arranges all the duels. Blades and blasters, and nobody ever dies. How come I get the feeling you're trying to take us for a ride? Keep on, 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 on
portfolio out to our gun. I hit my book, then you go to... This is for the best. We could use those credits from these duels, but using your real name is too risky. The Sith might have come across a cool manifest back on the Emperor Spire. I got you go back. Gee, no more you're rocking, Fajak. Slim up, boy, 